This is a lesson on comparing and ordering fractions that have the same numerator or they have the same denominator. So here are the lesson um, notes or rules that apply. So first of all, when numerators are the same, such as in a unit fraction like we looked at last time, um, the fraction with the lowest denominator is the largest fraction. Now you should be familiar with this because we did the unit fractions and the unit fractions are fractions with um, a numerator of one. So um, the same rule applies with those that we learned as with any fraction that has the same numerators. Um, the lowest denominator is the largest fraction. So this five and this eight, those are the denominators and the lower one is the larger fraction. And I've got a picture here to show you why. So these fraction strips are the same size. And this one's broken up into five pieces. And this one's broken up into eight pieces. Both of them have two colored pieces. But the one with five pieces um, is more, has more colored, because the pieces are larger. And that's why um, this rule applies. It might seem silly to you to say that the lowest number is the larger fraction, but it is only when both of the top numbers are the same and the bottom numbers are different. Then, then the lower number is the higher fraction. Now, the opposite applies when the denominators are the same. That's the bottom number. So, when the two bottom numbers are the same, or if there's more than those bottom numbers, the denominators are the same, then the fraction with the highest numerator is the largest fraction. So this one works the way that you would think it would go. Is, um, so if I have 3 fourths and 1 fourth, 3 fourths is larger than 1 fourth. So here's a picture showing. So we have two strips of the same length. They're both divided into four pieces. The top one has three colored and the bottom one has one colored. So my alligator eats the one with the larger numerator because that's a higher fraction. Okay, so you have to remember that. Um, let's do a practice. And so it says order the following fractions from greatest to least. So the biggest fraction to the smallest fraction. Use fraction strips or a number line to help order the fractions. So um, I'm going to let you try this first, and then we'll do it together. So please pause the video now. Um, order the fractions. So you have to draw strips or a number line, and then you have to write out the fractions in the correct order. So pause now. Okay, so now that you've done this, let us uh, I'll do it with you, or I guess you'll watch. So um, I'm going to draw each one of these fraction uh, fractions onto fraction strips. I'm just going to do it in the order that they are written. Alright, so um, this one needs to be divided into seven equal pieces. So that means that I'm not going to have a middle line. Uh, see how we do here. Okay, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then um, this one needs to be divided into five pieces. So again, I'm not going to have a middle line. Actually, with all of these, I'm not going to have a middle line. Um, five should be about this. Whoops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then um, with nine, well, first we need to divide it into three pieces. Oops, let's draw this properly. There we go. I'll do this one down here with three first as well. And then I'll go back to the nine and divide each of those three pieces into three other pieces. All right, now all I have to do is color them in. So I've got, whoops. Well, 
One, two, three. I've got one, oops. One, two, three. And one, two, three. And one, two, three. Okay, so now it's easy to tell if you didn't already just use the rule that I told you, um, which one is the greatest. So that would be here, three, three thirds, comma. Then the next biggest would be three fifths. And then the second smallest is three sevenths. And the very smallest is three ninths. And look at that, there's the rule that I gave you. When the numerators are the same, then the lowest number is the largest fraction. Okay, so your assignment is then on page uh, 196, and it's numbers 1 to 5.